got sufficient power to stop that car that's following us. Atomic force machine, which he calls a cyclotron. He invented this machine for defense against atomic bomb plants. But the machine will also destroy any type of electrical equipment within its range. And in criminal hands, could be used to threaten and blackmail every industry in the country. It would also be invaluable to an enemy power. Isn't it possible that Professor Chambers could have succumbed to the temptation of easy money and sold it to a foreign government? Nonsense, Anderson. Let's hear no more of that. The cyclotrode is gone. Chambers is in the hands of a ruthless gang of cutthroats. He must be found. How? I don't know. Duncan is an experienced criminologist. He's handled a number of such cases for the government. I suggest we delegate him to take complete charge. I agree. Good suggestion. Then it's up to you, my boy, and good luck. Thanks. I'll need it. chambers in the cyclotrode. They have put Duncan Richards in charge of the investigation. Then we have nothing to worry about. Don't underestimate him. Did you check the range and effectiveness of the cyclotrode? I did. It's definitely limited to a narrow band over a short range. Then I shall have to restore chambers to his normal mind and force him to build a cyclotrode of unlimited power. me to get the cyclotrode for you. And you did. Why? And now you're going to build a larger cyclotrode with power enough to paralyze any industry in the country which refuses to pay me tribute. Not if my life depends on it. There are worse things than dying, Professor. Unless you agree in just one minute, I will inject a more powerful drug into your veins which will entirely destroy your mind leaving you a hopeless idiot for the rest of your life. Decide, Professor. I agree. <laughs> I thought that you would. Make out a list of the materials needed. probably have everything here I need to build an adapter to raise the power of the cyclotrode, except an X7 transformer tube. 
Where can we get one? In the laboratory vault, the university. Ash, get one of the men and... What can I do for you, gentlemen? We're here on an errand for Professor Chambers. Professor Chambers? Where is he? Well, he's building a larger cyclotrode and sent us for the X7 transformer tube. Come on, sister. We know it's in the vault. Get it. away with something he took out of the vault. Did you see what it was? No, but he said Professor Chambers was building a larger cyclotrode and he wanted the X7 tube. The X7 tube? You know, Professor Chambers tricked them. The X7 tube is no part of the cyclotrode, but a special radium vapor tube we've been developing for a death ray machine. What do you suppose he wanted with that? My guess is that Professor Chambers will set up a death ray machine to attempt to kill the men who are holding him prisoner. Why, that tube is so highly radioactive that... Say, I'm missing a bet. What? The radium detector. With this radium detector, we can follow the X7 tube wherever it's taken. That'll surely lead us to Professor Chambers and probably the Crimson Ghost. Turn right at the next corner. Are you coming? This is all I need to complete the job. And you're ready to demonstrate it to the Crimson Ghost? Bring him and the cyclotrode over, and I'll show him something he'll never forget. Okay, I'll bring him over. I'll be ready when you return. Getting close. Let's go the rest of the way on foot. You better take this. Give me that wrench there, will you? Sure.
It's in there. Stay here in case anyone comes back. 